Cause I've been drinking on the Henny Sipping away my feelings Cause my spirit's feeling empty, I'm losing it My closest friends are showing me they envy And the one I love is showing she forgets me And I can't recall What up, what up? Welcome. Reporting live from Papa Do's. You know? That Came good, to get some food. That good Cajun food, you know, that good swamp thing. Right. Shout out to Papa Do's. Shout out to Papa Do's for real. We just came to take my daddy out. We had to call yeah. her daddy because she's he's in Colorado. Happy Father's Day. <laughs> Happy everyone. Father's Day to her dad. Happy everyone. Father's Day to everybody. Shout uh -huh. out to your real noodles. Right, and if you can get you some papados, I highly recommend it. Highly good, highly good. Waiting for the table. I think it's about to be up now. But we just wanted to record in, let y'all know what's been going on. We just moved here from Texas. So our first video was in Texas. So now we're back in the A. It's so beautiful. Well, it's not that beautiful, but like the scenery is nice, you know? Got the little jazz going on. But yeah, we waiting on our table. Um, got some good food coming out. About to smash it up. And we'll probably catch y'all at the table. Tell us what we want you to do is just tell us one good thing about your father. That, you know, in honors of Father's Day. Our memories, just memories. One good thing, go. Let's share, comment yeah. below. So, one thing about our dad. Okay, so I have two dads. One of them, my dad, the most, memorable thought that I have with my dad is going to the parks. Um, I was a little anti-social. I'm still anti-social. But he used to always force me to go meet new people and that's something that I respect about him. So he would refuse to play with me because I would only want to play with my father at the park. But he would be like, go meet a new friend and introduce me to him. To, to him. So I would go find a new friend, introduce him, and we would have to play. And I like the fact that he challenged me to, you know, do, try new things, I guess. So I guess that's, that, that carries along now that I'm 24 and old as fuck. Her dad seems like a very wise guy. Like, one of those guys that you would kind of want to marry one day. I'm going to marry him. Let's get it. No, you're not. Anyway. Um, my dad is a whole nother story, but my no, best her friend. Dad is and I love always my dad. Yes, that's that's my that's my number one. He's my best friend as far as guys. The only guy I'll ever love. Well, but um, yeah, he's pretty legit. He always has our back when we're, when he's here. My most memorable thing with my dad is actually it's a little slight stories time on a cruise a couple years ago, or no, on a cruise when we were I was like ten. Um, this white kid got mad at me and called me the N-I-G-G-E-R word. E-R, you... not A. <laughs> <laughs> because I won the game that we were playing. My dad, when he found out later at dinner, and I told him, first of all, he was pissed because I told him later at dinner. But when he found out what had happened, we collectively, along with all the police that were chasing him around that damn cruise, he chased that little boy and found his parents and tried to knock his parents out and I don't know what happened I think they contained my dad or something I really don't remember I feel like I got snatched away at that point but that's daddy that's Faye ever Matter since not. then I knew I would, if I would ever need anything it's a real like east coast thing you feel me like real rough Brooklyn day. all day not all day but yeah, so, so those are our tell daddies. us about your memorable moments and we would like to hear back from you. Please let us know. We'll catch y'all in a little. Bye. Bruno Mars and they 
play some boo boo. Some boo boo. Noticed as I was editing this that we forgot to end the vlog. I don't want to be in it right now. That's all right. Like, comment, subscribe. And I said you.